growing up, like my earliest memories, I've always felt God. And it's weird to explain, but I have these memories of just being five years old, praying, and, or little things. I did grow up in a Christian home, and unfortunately we didn't go to churches a lot because my parents didn't really like a lot of churches. I didn't really learn much, but I knew about him. And then once I got into high school, I always waffled back and forth. Like I'd be really good and I would read my Bible, I'd pray, and then there'd be moments where I didn't even give it a thought. I was more worried about fitting in, having friends, and I didn't feel like I belonged anywhere. I tried kind of molding myself into something that I wasn't. It was hard. You know, I'd been stabbed in the back a lot by friends and people I was trying to be friends with because I thought I should fit in, and they got in between my relationship. People I thought were my best friends, you know. Because of that, it made me have a lot of hatred, and I just never understood why. Like, you got so close to me, I thought we were great friends. And all of a sudden, they chose to hurt me with their friendship. I don't have that hatred anymore because I choose to forgive and move on now. But at the time, I was very angry. So that made it hard to trust people. I guess you could say I kind of went into like a depression phase, especially when we were in that like shutdown because of COVID. And even at that time, I didn't even really put any thought into God, unfortunately. Once we got out of COVID, and that's when I really started to, you know, get a Bible again and like basically pick up where I left off. And I think I did have a lot of help from my grandmother who kind of set me in the path that I should be on. Like she could tell that I wasn't on the right path. And, you know, she, she would get on me a little bit like, you, you know that you're called on me. Jesus is waiting for you, you know, and she was actually the one that showed me Faith Church. I started coming here and I really liked the experience. I've been to a few churches, but this one I kind of connected more with. I've been coming almost every Sunday, you know, and I've been bringing more people in, my friends, family. And it's a good community, and I feel like I fit in. Now I'm finding myself in a new spotlight, and I don't need to be anything but myself. I have Jesus, that's all I need. I can focus on that. He still wants me, he's still waiting for me. It's nothing to be ashamed of. And I can be the person that he wants me to be. I'm Liana, and I've decided to follow Jesus.